Hello and welcome to this week's screencast. My name is Spencer, aka Island Dog, and today I wanted to take you on a tour of WinCustomize.com. Specifically, I wanted to take you through and show you how to easily navigate through the various galleries we have here on WinCustomize and how to just find the skins you're looking for just a bit easier. Of course, you can also go directly to the skin galleries by clicking on one of the links here in the right hand sidebar. And we have all types of skins for changing your cursors, widgets, animated wallpapers, icons, um, window blind skins, etc. etc. But today I wanted to go in and show you some of the features that um, new members and old members alike might not know how to use. So clicking the main gallery link we have the main gallery and we have various sections here these sections uh, by the title will show you uh, different things uh, for instance these are the newest skins that were submitted to the public gallery here you see all of them these are just the latest skins that were uh, submitted you get a preview of a few here uh, these are the most popular skins by download and you can also filter down the libraries and some of the times, like if you just want to see ones from yesterday, you can select that. Uh, these are skins that were recently featured. Uh, we feature skins on the front page of When Customized, and these are just uh, the ones that were featured. That's a good way to find some skins you might have missed. And over here we have the recently updated skins, which, as it says, these are skins that were recently updated. And here we have the top master skins. Uh, people who have um, earned the rank of master skinners on when customized have the option to sell some of their skins. And as we see here, we have all types like uh, animated wallpapers, desktop X themes, window blind skins. Um, there's some really, really fantastic skins you can find here. Uh, most of them are reasonably priced and um, they're just pretty cool. And here you can also filter them down by gallery as well. And then we have the top skinners, which as it says again, these are just the top skinners by downloads on when customized. And you see here we have someone who has 12 million downloads, 9 million downloads, an incredible amount of downloads. And to go through some of these artists' um, personal pages, you'll find um, a lot of really great skins that you might not see in the public galleries. Now we'll move on to probably one of the most requested things that people ask me to talk about is how to find um, a specific skin or a specific type of skin in the galleries. And with that being said, uh, for today's example, we will use the object.gallery. Um, as many of you know, object.doc is a, an application which gives you a, um, a start bar, a launch bar um, on your screen. Uh, it can hold icons, uh, shortcuts, um, have uh, docklets, uh, things like that. So the object.gallery has uh, many elements to it. We have icons, uh, backgrounds, uh, docklets, which are like uh, uh, mini applications for weather, things of that sort. But today, for today's example, we're going to look for tabbed docs specifically. Tab docs backgrounds are used in Object Doc Plus. So as you see up here, we have our little breadcrumb links, and we're going to click the arrow next to the object doc. And this, is this, this applies to all the galleries. It'll just be slightly different depending on which gallery you are in. Clicking the arrow brings us a little menu here. And as you see, we have uh, selections for the dock icons, backgrounds, separators, overlays, and a, a variety of themes, docklets. But as I said, we want to do tab to backgrounds. So we'll just select that. And look at that, we have nothing but tabbed backgrounds. Makes it really easy to find what you're looking for. And you can do the same thing for um, overlays if you want, um, just icons. 
it's an easy way to find something specific like the tabbed backgrounds and you can also filter a little deeper and go for um, the downloads overall how many the most downloaded today um, ones that were featured the newest ones by ratings things like that as you see it's pretty easy to filter down to find skins and uh, types of skins that you want now we'll move on to another section which will be the visual styles and that will take us to our window blinds section now we also have other ways to uh, sort down the galleries and once again this is the same in all galleries we click uh, this drop down menu here and we have the option to sort by the downloads overall um, the downloads from today feature skins updated the newest uh, name rating things like that so clicking that, we're going to get some of the highest rated skins here. That's a really good way to find some of the most popular ones around. And being that we're in the window blinds gallery, window blinds has an advanced filter for window blind 6 and Vista ready skins, or both as you see here. So clicking any of these three links, it's going to take you to skins that are... Uh, flagged as either Vista ready, Window Blind 6 ready, or both. Now another way to see if a skin is Window Blind 6 or Vista ready is when you're on the specific page is look for these little icons here, Window Blinds ready or Vista ready. If you see if you see those, then the author has flagged that those skins are ready for either one of those and you should be all set. And the last thing I wanted to show you today is how to change the displayed galleries links over here. Over here on the right hand sidebar you see links to a bunch of galleries, all of them here. But what you might not have known is you can change these to display the galleries that you want. No need having them displayed if, if it's ones you never use. So click the edit button and you can check and uncheck uh, various galleries that you want to see there we have a bunch of galleries and we'll just uncheck a couple and you can also choose to display the icons or not I'm just gonna keep that and we click save and then I have my own custom list of galleries I want to see it's just another way of making it easier to navigate um, around so this was just a quick um, introduction to navigating through the galleries. Um, if you go to wincustomize.com, you can find my full article. You can also click the link that you see in this video, and it will take you to that article. And there you'll see uh, more detailed information along with screenshots. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week.